right, so today we're going to go over trigger not resetting on your 3D print. So make sure it's clear. Now you try to reset it. It doesn't go. There we go. So pretty much does it when it wants to do it. So we're gonna go over how I fixed it on this one. So for this 3D print, you can see, it's clear, it's good. It resets every time. So it resets every single time. All right, so what I noticed was if you watch the video on how the trigger resets, you'll notice that and here the crucifix is what you need to pull forward to reset the trigger but what's happening is it's not catching for this one it's not catching for this one so what I did to 3d print so it's an experiment but um, I took it out and I bent the crucifix up a little bit. I took a pliers and I bent the back of the crucifix up a little bit. So that way, when you're resetting the trigger, this can catch on to the crucifix and pull it forward as it's supposed to. complete and the Glock is ready to fire the next round. As the slide moves back, the hook on the connector is forced inward. This allows the trigger bar to move upward. As the slide returns forward, the trigger bar is then able to retain the firing pin. Releasing the trigger allows the connector to move back into place, again enabling the downward movement of the trigger bar. Okay, so I just took it apart off camera, bent it up, and now, as you will see, it resets every time. So that's how I fixed my resetting problems. Let me know what you think about this video down in the comments below.